my typical school day begins, I wake up, get dressed, and then I walk across to my first class. I have makerspace classes that I take. I have about a 15 minute walk to Text Bar. In the woodworking class, we had a couple projects that we had to do. <laughs> the main one was building a foldable camping stool. Two weeks of the class are pretty much free reign. You know how to use all the machines at that point. You know where the materials are. By the end of the class, you submit pictures of your stool. I completed it and it folds up, folds down, and I can sit on it, which is super cool. And particularly at CMU, the maker spaces are some of the best I've seen. I remember three years ago when I was college touring, I went to over 20 different top engineering schools and CMU by far had the biggest and most robust maker space. After my first class, I generally have about an hour in between until my second class, and that's when I'll run and get some coffee with friends. My favorite spot to go is La Prima in Wien Hall. Favorite place to study is Ansys Hall, the second floor, because they have really high windows that you can look out over. When I have a break for lunch, I love to go to the Exchange. It's the main sandwich place on campus, and I go there so often. The workers know my name and they know my order depending on what time of day it is. My favorite person there is Dave. He is always there with a smile to greet me. Although you're in a big city and you can go off on the weekends, you're surrounded by grassy quads. And on a really nice sunny day, I love to go outside and see everybody hanging out. The nice thing that you get with a smaller school is that the class sizes are a lot smaller, so you get more one-on-one -on -one time with professors, with TAs. Professors are also just really willing to meet with you if you have a question just about the class, if you want to learn more about their career, anything, and they generally have time for you every week. In my thermal fluids lab, there are maybe 14 or 15 students, and there's one professor at each session, so it's a 15 to 1 ratio, which is really, really good for just one class. I'm also in a Design 1 class where we are using uh, TechSpark to test out different brackets that we're building. Usually after I'm done studying on campus, I walk home from the engineering quad and I always love looking back at it, seeing all lit up at night and it reminds me that I'm so happy to be at CMU. I love the engineering component, I love the social component and I especially love being in the city of Pittsburgh and just all that CMU has to offer.